North Dakota has two paddlefish populations, and both exist in the Missouri River system. One exists above Garrison Dam uh, in the Missouri River system through Lake Sakakawea and up into the Yellowstone and Missouri Rivers in the Williston area. We've only got one other population here, and that's our Garrison Reach population. Uh, that we is This population between Garrison and Oahe Dams. So even though this population down here doesn't support a recreational fishery, it still can provide really good insight on how to properly manage paddlefish in North Dakota. Bailey and his crews have tagged, weighed, and measured around 10,000 paddlefish between Garrison Dam and the headwaters of Lake Oahe since 2006. And we've been able to estimate there's usually around 9,500 to around 12,000 paddlefish in the Missouri River upstream of Bismarck at the time of sampling. And given that male paddlefish typically uh, attempt to spawn once every two years, females typically every two or three years, uh, the number of fish we see annually in the Missouri River upstream of Bismarck probably represents about half of the adult or sexually mature paddlefish in this population. Seasonal movements of paddlefish in the Garrison Reach are interesting too. A lot of times later in the summer, there's very few to uh, no paddlefish uh, in the Missouri River above Bismarck. Uh, that these fish uh, do have uh, some annual migration patterns that they go through. Uh, that these fish, in all likelihood, are spending the bulk of their time in the headwaters of Lake Oahe, where zooplankton foraging conditions are much better for these fish. Paddlefish in the Garrison Reach do swim upstream in May when they get the urge to spawn. This reach of the Missouri River is likely way too modified uh, due to the Garrison Dam for these fish to successfully naturally reproduce. If conditions don't allow paddlefish to reproduce in the Garrison Reach of the Missouri River, how is this population sustained? Still see some mortality associated with uh, entrainment to paddlefish through Garrison Dam, uh, but in all likelihood, that's one of the ways that we are uh, maintaining this fish population. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.